Welcome to NAB Show 2024. The preeminent event for the entire media and broadcast industry. Right here in Las Vegas. Ashley within broadcast, joining me is Uday of Entertainment Technologies. Nice to see you. Hi Ashley. Hi. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Uh, so tell me, um, where does the company stand right now in the media and broadcasting market? Uh, it's a very exciting company. Uh, we started this company last year, me and my co-founder Mark Turner. Uh, Mark is uh, a senior consultant with Movie Labs. Movie Labs is a company that uh, works for all the studios, Hollywood studios, for the standards. So he was the guy who authored the Vision 2030. And uh, what we did last year is we joined hands and we decided to build solutions to help companies move to Vision 2030. So that's what our goal is. Very good. Yeah. And so what trends are you noticing as far as your technology in the media and broadcasting market? And how have you There's kind of adapted very, with that? We are in a very interesting phase, media industry. Right, so there are two or three very important trends going on. One is all about the AI and the Gen AI and how do we bring that whole Gen AI use cases into the media industry. Secondly, the Vision 2030 concept, which is software-defined media workflows. Now, what is happening is there's a lot of pressure on costs, so there's a lot of focus on automation. And uh, software-defined media workflows is the way to actually achieve that cost savings. Yeah. So what are you showcasing here currently at NAB? So this is the platform that we have called Media Mesh. Uh, Media Mesh is the software-defined workflow platform. This is the first ever platform in the industry that focuses on exactly what Vision 2030 talks about. Uh, so what we have is a platform that uh, has three things. Uh, one is to design the workflow. First ever, a platform that can help media companies to visualize their workflows with the help of the movie labs visual language which got released recently so this is the first ever visual language that any uh, media industry person can use to depict and design their workflows and we have a specialized designer tool for doing that and once you have designed the tool uh, once you've designed the workflows you can then configure the workflows with different products, you know, every step in the workflow can be configured, whether it needs to be a service or it's an input or an output, whether it's a transcoder engine, whether it's an AI solution, like a synthetic dubbing solution or a translation service, all can be integrated through the configuration tool. And then comes the orchestrator, which is basically once you have designed, you have configured, you execute it very seamlessly. And that's what the product is all about. Yeah. And so can you tell me a little bit more about your latest developments and who you might be targeting with your prospective use cases? Sure. So uh, what we have is three main products. One is a media mesh, which I spoke about. But we also have something called media sati. Uh, the sati word is a Hindi or Hindu word for co-pilots. So, uh, so it's a media co-pilot. So basically, uh, it has this very interesting solution where people can have a co-pilot for any kind of job function they can do. Like for example, if you are a production unit person, you have a co-pilot that can quickly tell you about, hey, where's the next shoot going to happen? You know, the, the, the pilot is going to talk, talk to you about it. So it's going to use a lot of Gen AI technology. Uh, that's Media Sati. And then the third solution is uh, about avatars, uh, testing QA avatars. So that is basically replacing all the manual testers with AI bots. And that's very interesting. So these are the three products we are working on. And so what would you say is the future of entertainment technologies? Uh, future is very, very interesting and very exciting from the perspective that new kind of concepts and contents are coming up. As you can see, there's a lot of focus on podcast now. A lot of influencer economy has started. Uh, short form content is becoming a new thing. So with all these new kind of concepts, uh, the industry has to evolve. And to evolve, they have to have flexible workflows. And that's what we offer them to do. Yeah. Yeah. So for those that want to know more information, please check out their website. Thank you so much for speaking with us today. Thank nice you so meeting much, you. Ashley. Thank you.